Hello, I'm making another video because my parents totally just walk in my room whenever they please while I'm doing a video to bother me and it fucking frustrates me. But I am doing a review on Wish, the app. Um, for the most part, I haven't really had any problems with it. Um, it comes from, I believe, China or it's either China, Japan or Korea, one of those two or one of those three. And currently I'm wearing something that I had gotten and I paid $13 for this. It's very decent. I'm a tiny person. I'm only five foot one. I have a high metabolism. So this website clothing wise works out perfect for me because they already make stuff small. So I can automatically assume, well, if I order a small, I'm already going to like, this is a small. They didn't have an extra small, um, but I can automatically assume that it's going to fit me because I'm small and they make stuff small, so remember that. Um, I got this. This is older. I've had this for a while, but this is just something I got on there. Um, some of the products, though, I will say, depending on the price, um, the material isn't as soft I mean comfortable like like this like the inside it almost feels I just don't like touching it I mean I don't mind it against my skin as much but with my fingers you know you have more sensories in your fingers so it's not comfortable like if you were wearing something like this on your hands you wouldn't like it Let's just put that way. I don't know if maybe it's because of my ADD or what, but yeah. And I like cheetah print. I have a cheetah print tattoo. And these come with pants as well that I have hanging in here. And they're basically the same thing as this. I'm not going to pull them out because then that would mean I would have to put them back on the hanger. But that's one of them. Another thing that I got was this sweatshirt. Now this sweatshirt... It's a nice sweatshirt. I mean, honestly, it's really soft on the inside. I've barely worn it, but it's pretty soft. But yet again, the material is not the greatest. This this one is. This outfit is. Um, but it's... It was $13. This was probably like 3 bucks. I got this, oh, I got this shirt, damn it, people keep snapchatting me, fuck off, okay, it's like a crop top, eh, yeah, I, this one isn't as bad as the other two, like, like the way it feels wise, but you can definitely tell that it's cheaper, like it's cheaper material, it looks good, like, to the outward appearance, but when you touch it, you can tell the difference. Next, another thing I had gotten um, that I need to wash, but I got this. It was a, Again, it was a belly shirt. I like it because it's kind of like got a 90s look to it. It says I have no tits. And it's a crop top. Um, I like it, but yet again, the material doesn't seem very nice you get what I'm saying it's just not it's crap crappy material it's kind of like material like scraps I feel like they use scraps of material to make this stuff okay on to another one I got a dress this one this material doesn't feel very gross which I like it says dress pretty on the front and then on the back it says play dirty I got this I like it so far and it's kind of stretchy it's actually a very stretchy material um, but I'm tiny so I don't really ha I don't have curves um, I had gotten something else hold on one second I, I don't know I don't know where it is I have other stuff that's still coming in the mail so yeah I'll probably make another video about that um,
This is another one, again, with the material. I mean, it's shiny, and it, that's exactly how it feels. You know, when material is shiny like this, it, you know, it's a certain texture to it. But it also feels the same exact way on the inside throughout the entire outfit. These uh, also have matching leggings that are, it's super adorable, it's so adorable. I, I, even though the material isn't perfect, I still really love the outfits and I still wear them. Um, I haven't bought any makeup from there. I was actually hoping maybe I could find someone online that had bought makeup from there. Um, but from the sounds of it, if you buy foundation on there, it doesn't dry on your face and apparently it ends up like sticky. So honestly, I would just stick to the Pro Matte, if you know what I mean. Pro Matte L'Oreal. Yeah, that's what I use. And that's like my top favorite um, stuff. So, yeah. I would, yeah. Um, so there you have it. Uh, that's everything. My review is, I mean, I, I like the website, even though some of the products aren't that great. I just want... You know, some of their stuff is very comfortable though. Like this outfit is so comfortable. So comfortable. So comfortable. Um, but yeah, I just, just, you know, it all, it all depends. I mean, you get what you pay for. So if you're paying for something a little more expensive, then, you know. But I would remember just the size difference. Just remember that. And... Um, most of their stuff is very cheap on there, most of it. Not so much their clothing, but most of their makeup is cheap. And, um, yeah, you can, you can get stuff for really cheap, like that, that crop top was only like three bucks. So, yeah. Um, I do like this website. I would recommend it. Um, I've never really had a problem with it. Other people are just kind of nitpicky. I mean... I'm not very nitpicky, um, as long as it looks cute and it's wearable and it's not like really uncomfortable, then I'll, I love it. So yeah, peace out babes.